Scorpio, Scorpio. What's up, Scorpio? What it do do? What's good in the hood? Okay, so we are going to do what your soulmate needs from you in this union. What do they need? Oh, we got a lot turning over. What do they need from my Scorpios today? Let's give it one more shuffle and then we'll pull a card. Hope y'all doing good. Hope y'all doing good. What they need? Surrender, worry. Oh, Scorpios are overthinkers. And I can say that because I'm a Scorpio. So I know. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. I know how it is, baby. Surrender, worry. This says make a commit commit <laughs> make a commitment not to lead an anxiety driven life when worries arise breathe them out of your body focus on the power of your heart and have faith that spirit is guiding you always oh okay so in the present connection why do i feel like worrying about just the simple things of daily life like did the kids get to school on time why i feel like this scorpio is out of town and they left their partner in charge of the things that they would normally do for the family and you call in their family it's like did you do this did you remember to do that did you do that it's like you worrying and you not enjoying your time away scorpio come on Enjoy your free time. You're not going to always have it. You're going to go back to those those responsibilities when you get off vacation. Let the mistakes happen because if they happen and you call and you're doing whatever you're doing to try to make sure things are in place, it's already going to happen. Ain't nothing you can do about it anyway. So your person is like, man, I wish my Scorpio would stop worrying so much. they like, stop worrying. It is what the, what the T.I. is. Hmm. Worry comes with a sense of control, too, because you are used to being in that space where you can control the dynamic, and now that you're not, yeah, because it just got the five of pentacles, like, feeling left out. Now that you're not in that space, worry shows, you know, an authentic concern, but it also raises another trigger of not being able to control the situation. Okay, let's get some tarot. <sighs> <clears throat> What we got for Scorpios? Holy Spirit, what we got? The Five of Swords and... Oh, interesting combination. I've been getting some interesting combinations here. The Five of Swords and Victory. Oh, I see. So the worrying that's going on in this connection that is distributed by the Scorpio is like a loose, loose situation. Cause I just, I just kind of gave that example. Cause if you're worrying and things don't go the way that you plan them to go, or your partner does them differently than you, it kind of brings anxiety to both people. If you're worrying and then you're expressing that concern to them when it's already happened. And I'm talking about just things that are out of totally out of your control. I use the example of being out of town and having your partner do, having your soulmate do the things that you would normally do, but they may do it differently. And you calling every five minutes or every other hour to make sure that it's done efficiently the way that you would do it. But if you would just allow them room to do how they do, it's still going to get done. It just may not get done the way that you want it to get done. And when you get back, you can do how you do. But while you're away, Scorpio, it's time for you to enjoy and have some fun. And as soon as you do that, as soon as you enjoy and have fun, look what you got. That's the Six of Wands. This is victory. This is rejoicing. This is having a good time. Both of you guys will be happy because your partner will be happy that you start worrying. And you'll be happy that you just released that burden of worry. Because it's taking up too much space in your energy. Okay. That's what your soulmate need right now from you, Scorpio. Let's get a heart message. Let's see what we got here. For my Scorpios. What's the heart message for this connection, please? Holy Spirit. What do we got? 
we have ooh, life here we go life is a series of consistently shifting cycles when we resist change <laughs> I'm sorry. I cannot make this up. When we resist change, we resist the natural flow of life and create unnecessary stress. What is stress? Worry. What do we have here? Worry. Okay. Go with the flow. You will be surprised where it leads. Okay. So release the worry. That's all it says. Release the worry. Go with the flow. Don't try to control it too much. Just let it be. And if it's meant to be, it's going to be. Everything that's meant to fall in place will fall in place, whether you're there or not. I know that's hard to accept, but sometimes we just got to let it go. Let it flow. Let it go and let it flow. That's that's the name of y'all little mini read. Let it go and let it flow. Okay, Scorpio. Thank you, guys. We're going to move right along, right along. Bye-bye.